what we were talking about yesterday is is like when you're painting outside, you kind of have to pick a rhythm mm -hmm. of how how the whole thing is going to work. So yesterday we decided this would be our star, so we could go further on this rose, which is right up there. Okay, and then these were the roses in the background, which have now mysteriously disappeared. And then these roses were just popping out. To balance these two, what you want to do is you, you can paint these in and glaze them down so that this one stands out more. Mm -hmm. Or what you can do is you can just paint these with less paint and less detail. Okay, that's there. Now we'll put this into here like this. These have smaller leaves. This is, you know, the bottom one. This Up towards the sun, the leaves are bigger. So we, we go, okay, this is in here. Now we want to get this background in. Now when you're painting these kind of leaves, you use a little bit more turpentine because you want to be able to round them off right in the beginning instead of having raggedy edges. And I'm just going to tell you about where these leaves are and how they're going down. Here. So in other words, I'm not painting as precisely as I was here, okay? Mm -hmm. So I can come in now and say, okay, this is here. <clears throat> I'm not making these into petals yet. I'm just going to show you where the, the sun is hitting. Notice I'm, I'm changing the greens as I go, so that everything, if you use the same green over and over, it's all flat. Mm -hmm. So you want to keep um, varying it, and then you can go back later and decide what else to do with it. This goes here. Your eye gets led by things like this. Okay, here's this leaf coming down like this. And you can go through and get the detail later. Then there's another leaf catching light like this. Now watch what this does. It leads your eye right to there. Then I say, okay, this is here, like this, to here. And then I have a little piece of light like that. Now you see how that changes everything? If you pick that as your major piece, then you want to have the paint thicker on that one so that it comes out in space. Then you have to connect it to these over here. All right, let's call it a day. You can go back to work. Okay, but at least you see what I need, yeah. right? Okay.